Hey gang, believe it or not, that was the intro to Ain't That Peculiar by Marvin Gaye. Sure sounds different without Marvin Gaye singing, doesn't it? Um, anyway, the guitar is done by the great Marv Tarplin, who was one of the Motown players back then, uh, written by Smokey Robinson and Marv Tarplin, among a couple of others. So uh, what's really cool about it is the riff doesn't just bang out chords. Like most Motown, it's going to play uh, you know, something inventive. So uh, we'll play this over. It's nice and simple, and uh, I think it works pretty well. So anyway, this should be a pretty short lesson. All right, so here we go. All right, gang, let's go over this. Uh, first things first, you can download the tab from the link in the description below. might make your life a little bit easier. All right, second thing, the sound, keep it clean. I've got mine on the middle position, which is both pickups, bridge, and neck. Just gives it a little bit of a lighter tone uh, for the rhythm that we're going to do here. Okay, so it is a song in E, three chord trick, E, A, and B. Uh, kind of goes with a little, but there, we're not going to bang out chords, okay? That was almost never done in Motown songs. So we're going to start out um, over this bass that's going like this. And over that pedal note, we're going to start out with this line. All right, that's just a little walk down. Um on that first note of E, we're going to play the uh, E on the seventh, so fifth string, seventh fret, then five, then four, then three, ending on two. We're going to do that twice. On the record, that doubles with the piano. Okay, over the E chord in the sequence, um, we're going to play, um, there's two bars that are picked up of this, there's two bars of that, and then there's of the walk down, and then there's twice we're going to play this. Okay, we're going to play that twice, and then the song itself is going to be begin. Let's go over that main riff, because that's one of the two main riffs. So over the E chord, you're basically always going to be playing this. We've got an E pedal note going. gives us a nice suspended sound there. What we're doing is over that E pedal we're playing a, this is all on the 4, 3, and 2 strings, we're playing a D triad, so 7, 7, 7, then an E triad, which is 9, 9, 9, then we're playing up here on this A triad, which is 11, 9, 10, we're not hanging on that one and then back down to the 9, the E triad, and then back down to the, the 7, the D triad. Okay, so it sounds like this. It's repeated all the time. And, and basically it's a nice suspended sound a nice suspended sound over that E chord. Sounds a heck of a lot better than just banging out <coughs> chords. All right, when it goes to the A, we're going to play this. Two bars of that. Okay, oh, I should say when the song begins, there's four, it does this little lick four times. that four times, and then it goes to the A, does that twice. Okay, so what does it do on the A? Well, again, we're using little triads. Motown, a lot of triads in Motown, right? So a lot of little triads. Here we're playing on the four, three, and two strings again. We're playing uh, a D triad, which is uh, four, two, three. That's, again, this is always on the four, three, and two strings, respectively. So four, two, and three. And then to an A triad which is 2-2-2. Two, two, two. You'll notice I'm hammering on on that second one. Uh, 
Uh, one more thing I'll just note in passing here. I'm using pick and finger, so I'm picking on the fourth string down, and I'm playing with my, with my second finger, my middle finger, and my ring finger, my third finger. I'm picking up. I'm plucking up with those strings. All that's great, but you know what? It sounds great if you just pick it too. It sounds fine. So whatever is your preference, that's what you should do. Okay, we'll do two bars of that, and then we're back to the old... Two of those. And now we do the usual, which is to start at B. So that one is just an E triad to a B triad, but it's just the same thing that we did in A, but moved two frets up. So we're playing the E triad here. So that will be um, six, four, five, and then four, four, four. Shifting down two frets, doing what we did before over the A. Extra bar of A, which makes the song just a little bit peculiar. And then we're back to E. And that is it. Well, gang, I hope you enjoyed that one, short and sweet. Uh, always nice to get in a little Motown here and there. All right, we'll see you on down the road.